how is it going everybody hope you're having a wonderful day as always today's video is going to be a continuation of the mods video that i did where i did the the 50 dollars and under exterior mods today we're going to be covering the interior they're nothing nothing pricey nothing experienced but they do go up just a little bit this is going to be 60 dollars and under although most of them are under 30. so with that said let's get to it Now, you know the fifth gen by far is the most favorite most liked modern camaro of all time i mean it just is it's outperformed outsold outlasted the, the used prices are going up i mean it's just a wonderful car but we as owners we as hobbyists we as car people want to make these cars our own so what we do is we find little ways to change and tweak and twerk and all that stuff some of them are very pricey some of them are really inexpensive today i'm going to show you some that like i said are 60 dollars and under most are under 30 dollars and some of them are almost free <laughs> so let's get to it first up let me go over a couple things now this depends totally totally on you your skill level your skill set what you want to try to do and all that okay because if you look you have all these pieces like this right here that's silver this piece right here that's silver that's removable these side panels right here pop right out you have the big door panels over there you have the door handles themselves you know you have these we'll talk about these later just disregard them but the piece that goes around it you know and what I'm trying to say is those can all be painted or wrapped in any kind of wrap you want whether it be carbon fiber a color chrome whatever you want it runs the gambit out there and I mean you, if you're gonna paint any of this stuff right I mean just a cut one can of primer one or two cans of paint will do both door panels you know it's just it runs the gambit this chrome button right here i've seen a lot of people online paint that and stuff is that what you want that's totally up to you that's what makes this so great they're our cars we can do what we want to with them but i wanted to start off with that because like i said number one it depends on your skill level and skill set and number two whether you want it painted or whether you want to wrap it and a lot of mosquitoes flying around this time of year that's odd a lot of people will actually wrap them that way they could take the wrap off later if they decide they want to sell the car Plus, it gives them, gives them the opportunity to change it, right? Because you can order uh, sections of vinyl that go on there that has any logo on there you want, your car name and all that. But to do a wrap like that that's already pre-printed and all that, it's going to be a lot more costly. I mean, with that, you're looking upwards of 100 bucks just for the, the panels. And I mean, they start at 100 and go up. But painting them yourself or wrapping them yourself, I mean, you can get a piece of vinyl to do both doors 15, 20 bucks and have that done. So that's number one. Number two is a continuation of what I actually, one of the mods that I've recommended for the outside. And that is the vinyl wraps or the vinyl decals. Like I said, you can get them in a multitude of colors and all that stuff. But where is it going? Right here. Right there, that bow tie emblem. Some people don't like it gold. Some people, like me, I have it on order. I'm going to do mine black, but you can do it in red, blue, like like any color again. All you got to do is a little research. And if they don't have a particular color, most people, if you request a certain color, will do it in that color. Might cost a dollar or two more, but hey, I mean $7.99 to $15.99 shipped and you've got <laughs> you've got it done right so that's number two number three very simple easy mod again and it really adds a lot to your vehicle i mean you might not use it that much but when you do need it it'll be like wow that looks so good and what am i talking to about this time led lighting and in particular the led light that goes up here i recently changed mine to red but again they have different colors red yellow blue 
purple green whatever color you want it's available so there's your another mod and not only is it just a mod for the price of uh, for the price of two bulbs you can change this light here and you can also change the light in your trunk that's right for under 20 bucks and it, like it just adds to the ambiance Next up on the mod list, and I'm not even going to count them anymore because I'm just going to throw them out there and I'll insert the mod numbers just like in the other video. But this video is along the same lines, the LED lighting, right? You change this, well these cars don't have footwell lighting, right? And today we're talking about the 5th gen Camaro, but it could be done to any vehicle out there, okay? So if you look down here, I'll show you. I installed red LED lighting in this car in the footwell that way whenever I open the doors I have something to see what's in the floor to see where I'm stepping or if I drop something all I have to do is reach up here turn the light on the way I have mine wired in and I'll put that video up there in case you're interested I have mine to where when I turn this light on or the doors are open or the key fobs pressed that light comes on and the footwell lighting comes on at the same time that's just the way I like it that's the way I want it and I knew I wanted red but you can get other colors I mean you can get the ones that change colors you can have it beat to the music you know but those kits are a little bit more pricey this particular kit was under 40 bucks so and it's from fast tech a lot of the stuff I'm gonna show you is from fast tech just because I was on their website it's super easy to find stuff on there but you can search YouTube Amazon wherever you prefer to shop and find these same exact things so really cool but yeah footwell lighting super great mate like it gives you light in the floorboard again you can get yellow blue green purple whatever and it just it just makes owning the car that much more yours and that much more fun now this next mod is really cool okay it used to be called the 75 cent mod and a lot of the old timers used to do it to change the way their cars look. I mean, just it just adds that factor that's wow, you know, nobody else had it. And now it costs, you know, for like 17 feet of it, it's like $12, $13 on Amazon. Not expensive. But with that said, where it goes, what it does, uh, anywhere you have a crack like this, right? Top, bottom, you know, you want to stay away from your lighting that your factor that the car has but along the bottom right along here along there come inside all along here all along there the other door panel along this groove right here around your instrument cluster you know just anywhere there's a crack you can add this mod again it's called the 75 or was called the 75 cent mod now i think it's like the two dollar mod but any color you can dream of they have it in this and it's just a little plastic piece it's got a round end to it and a little piece of plastic that sticks out right i mean put it around your radio or anything and you just all you do is you take it and it comes with a little tool to open up the crack a little bit more if you need to and you just take your finger and push it and run it in and it's just super great it's super super easy to do super cheap and it just makes your color your car pop and it actually looks like your car was meant to come with it you know if you don't overdo it you know some people tend to go way out there and just do everything and that's fine that's your car if that's what you want but once you go past a certain point it becomes almost like a ricer mod or kind of cheesy looking so this mod is excellent just use it small quantities is what i'm trying to say but again it's your car do what you want but I just want to throw that one out there because like I said 12 to 14 bucks for 17 feet I mean it's just super great and I'm sorry to be fanning but we got mosquitoes down here my god and I know what it's from I hate to say anything about it especially on video but anyhow there you go the two, the 75 cent mod really cool product really easy to do now this next mod is actually another lighting product okay and it's really cool because of the way it works it it goes in and looks like the cord 
the welt cord that I just mentioned or the 75 cent mod it looks just like it but what is so cool about this it is called the it is called the type s interior trim lighting okay and what it does like I said it looks just like the welt cord it's shaped just like it but it's a translucent and it has a little box that you can velcro anywhere in your car right in your glove box up under the dash anywhere and the welt cord the end of it i'm just gonna call it welt cord because it looks like welt cord you take that you plug it into the the light and then plug the light itself into the little box that you mounted under the dash wherever you want to hide it and it actually lights up and you can change the color of lights and all that stuff so theoretically if your car doesn't have lighting you can have this whole area lit up around it you can have around your radio lit up around here lit up your doors wherever you want the kit comes with what's i forget how many inches of of the the tube the, the translucent welt cord i forget how many feet it comes with i'll put all the info in the pictures and videos and stuff so you can see it the box can handle four of those tubes so if you know you're going to be using more than just that one piece go ahead and order the four pieces of the extra tubing while you're at it because like i said it can handle up to four four sections of the car so it's really cool and like i said you change colors with it or any of that stuff but it adds the lighting that that this car comes with this car doesn't have it on the dash because they don't want anything being in your field of view but this car does have it along the tops of the door panels which makes it really cool now the, the, the first gen the first half of the fifth gens you can't change the colors but the later models you can you can change it to red blue green pink whatever color you know and but these cars you can't it's kind of like a bluish green but they're still really cool when you're driving down the road at night it just adds a little bit of a really sexy ambiance the type s trim lighting kit really cool and it's under 20 bucks did i mention that the whole kit is under 20 dollars and all you got to do is put plug the harness into your cigarette lighter which makes it even that better now this next little section of products i'm going to talk about are basically covers okay now you could buy the whole kit the kit to complete everything in your car but I'm going to list them individually because I don't know if your budget will allow you to spend $200, $300 on the complete kit. So each one of these pieces is under the $60. In most cases, they're under $30, okay? But first up is going to be the heat and AC vent covers. It's just an aluminum, brushed aluminum painted cover that slips over these black dials. And again you can get them in red orange yellow green blue whatever you want just goes over both of them and it allows you to take all of this and just add a little bit of pop to it if that's what you so choose so they're very cool they're, they're 55 dollars i think because like i said they're, they're brushed aluminum and they're custom painted well not custom painted they are painted to whatever color you want you can match it to your car or you just buy red and orange and whatever so heat and air heat and air knob control covers 55 bucks from fast tech again you can find them plastic you can find them cheaper on ebay amazon and all that i'm just using fast tech because i was on their site looking around and found these things so that's why i'm using them next up on the list is another really cool mod and we used to do this back in the day because we didn't like the the metal or or just solid black pieces that i'm fixing to show you and what we're talking about is and it's still solid black today right these door pins and the little round piece that goes around them, okay you can get those in brushed aluminum you can get them in chrome you can get them in black but but these these are plastic okay you can get them in metal for a better better feel is what i'm trying to say again you can get them in black you can get them in chrome silver painted whatever color you want and they're only like 30 bucks for a pair and like i said they're, they're machined aluminum so they fit perfect they look really good and they add that styling touch to your car that just says this is my car i wanted to go back here for a second because like i said this is interior and yes part of the tr the trunk area is considered interior i mean it's on the inside of your car now right now mine's kind of dirty 
It's got a few leaves and I had to haul some trash stuff off. But what in the world could we be talking about back here? Like I told you, you could change that light right there and make it any color you want to match the interior. But what I'm talking about right now is going to be this piece right here. There are, there is a piece, it's a truck latch cover. You can get it in any color, it's metal. You can get it in any color. You can get it with basically anything on it. You can get it that says SS, Heartbeat of America, Chevrolet, bow tie emblems on both sides, whatever you want. Again, any color, almost, well, almost any color, the main colors. I know you can get it red, I know you can get it orange, I know you can get it black with laser etched writing on it to make it stand out. And that just adds, like I said, another another piece of customization to your vehicle to make it more yours. The price for those are 58 bucks. Like I said, $60 and under. So, like, it, it's just another detail, another thing to make it yours okay now as i'm going through these these are just things that i found and that i like and some of them i have on order for my cars and there's more out there like the the strut that holds up the trunk the struts that hold up your hood the side panels that cover up your tail lights and all that those are those cost more so that's not why they're in this list there are other things you can do like like these like i said mentioned them before you can actually buy these and even these that are painted they're they're actually the paint the color that you want with the white on it rather than it being black but again they cost more i think they're somewhere around 120 to 150 bucks so that's why they're not in this list <laughs> Just like with the heating and AC controls, the covers for that, right? Goes here and here. They also have one that you can get for your headlights. Again, they're aluminum. They're, they just slide right on. They stay on. They don't pop off. You can get them black with a chrome accent. You can get them silver, red, green, blue, yellow, whatever you want. But that just, you know, if if you're going to do some, right, where are you going to start? Where are you going to stop? Are you going to stop with just that, or do you want to keep going? Because that cover for the headlights is $32. Not pricey, like I said, but when you add it all up, if you buy the whole kit to do everything, a couple hundred bucks. So figure out what you want, pick and choose, order, because you might not want the whole kit. You might not want your whole car done. Because, like I said, it runs the gamut. I mean, you can even get rings that go around this. The speakers. You can get pieces that go down here. And it just costs more. That's all. I'm trying to keep it cheap. Because right now, I don't know, I can't spend a lot of money. Dang, mosquitoes. Because right now, I can't spend a lot of money. So, with that said, here comes the next mod. Now my car being a SS to SS, I have heads up display. Not all cars have them. So when your car doesn't have it, you have a blank spot where the controls go. And that's called the ignition plate. So, and it's just a flat piece of metal. It looks like it, it, it's just stuck there. I mean, uh, what in the world? You know, there is a remedy for that. And on Fastex website, it's called the Ignition Plate Logo. Again, you can get it in almost any color. You, uh, any Chevrolet emblem, SS, says Camaro, I mean, you can get Corvette. Just search around. Like I said, Fastex is not the only place that offers them, but they're really cool. If mine didn't have the heads-up display, I know I would have one. It probably says SS, but where it goes, Ignition Plate, right? Well, there's your ignition. The plate goes right there. And like I said, if you don't have the heads-up display, you don't have those controls, so it's just a blank piece of plastic goes across there. And they are 32 bucks at Fastech. Again, you can probably find them cheaper somewhere else, but just another option to customize your car. Next up is a really cool item, and I'm, I'm going to get these for my car eventually, but what it is, it's a little box, and you mount it on your door panels you can do it via double-sided tape you can do it velcro whichever one you choose and there's a little piece of tape that you put down on your door jam if you have dark interiors like I do mine being black 
and all you do is you can order it with your custom logo your car name favorite emblem family name anything you want to do these people can do it for you and all it is is a light a projector lamp so when you open your door it slides across that, across that little piece of tape i was talking about and down on the ground it will shine your logo super cool super cool i mean like i said if my car had a name i could put it in there if i wanted it to say chevy ss or camaro ss or just project the chevrolet emblem the bow tie on the ground it when you open your door it gives you some light on the ground to see what is at your feet what you're stepping into you know before you get into your car plus it gives it a little bit of personalization which is what this whole thing this whole car world is about making it yours and they are 42 dollars i think they are and i'm going to get some for mine you can count on that Now this next mod I have been kind of torn about doing because it's super cheap. I mean you can get a whole pack of what you need to do it with for 20 bucks from Walmart. Or you can get it as one particular color for like $10 and up. And the reason I've been torn in it is because at one time I like the way it looks and one time I don't like the way it looks. I'd like to change it. And what I'm talking about in particular is this. Turn around and show you. The stitching. On these cars is white okay now over time they'll turn color a little bit you know you're putting your hands on the stuff they'll they'll yellow they'll bleach out because of the sun and all that but you can see you got them in the back the front the headrest the shift boot right the armrest now how can you change it you may be asking there is actually a permanent fabric marker that you can buy I mean, you could use a Sharpie, okay? I've seen people online using Sharpies, and all you do is you take a brand new Sharpie of the color that you want, make sure it's got the sharp tip. You just touch the center of the stitch, right? And it'll bleed out, and when it gets to where you want it to stop, you take the Sharpie off, and then that sets it. Then you take a mixture of vinegar and something else. You'll have to look it up. I'm not going to go into that because that's not how I'm going to be doing mine if I do it. The way I actually recommend is the easiest way. And that's to buy the, the fabric markers. Sharpie makes them. And there's some other makers out there. Some of them have bigger heads. Some of them have fine points. But with the regular fabric marker, all you have to do... And I'll put the video clip in. But you just take the marker, run it up and down the stitching. Take a towel, microfiber towel, uh, paper towel, anything. And then you wipe over the leather. And then that will take it off of the leather because the leather is not fabric. But this being cotton, it, it is fab considered fabric, so it will actually dye that stitching. Again, yellow, blue, green, black, orange, whatever color you want, doesn't matter. And that's what makes it so cool. That's what makes all these mods so cool. Making it yours, making it your own, and just enjoying having the car. And that's what I tell you at the end of all my videos. Get out there and enjoy your car and uh, it doesn't matter if it's from something as small as doing this to changing out this radio system to the later radio st uh, systems that has the touch screen on it and everything it, it's your car do what you want to i would really like to change out my steering wheel. i love the steering wheel but i like the ones that have the flat bottom you know where it's flat along here so i've been thinking about changing it out to a 1le but I don't know. I mean, it's 300 bucks for a steering wheel. But when, like I say, when I get the thing, I love the steering wheel. So what I'll probably do is order some vinyl for this. I mean, I actually have the vinyl order for this. But putting the vinyl on this and then changing this to like a red. So I got the carbon fiber to match my bow ties coming for this. But change this to like a red to match the color of the car. Again, it's endless. I mean, I could do that with a small brush and some model paint. I have model paint inside the house from where I used to build models. So, the point I'm trying to make, it's all about enjoying your car. You could you could do any of this. Again, like the paint. Paint door panels, you can paint this. You can paint this around here. If you don't have leather or anything, you can paint that whole section. You can put vinyl lettering on it, vinyl wraps. You can paint this bezel around your instrument cluster any color you want right like i was saying changing the stitching color your car do what you want make it your own get out there and enjoy it is the main fact 
if you get nothing else from any of my videos I want you to learn to these things are expensive right this could this car brand new was like forty three thousand dollars back in 2012 cuz it's a 2012 I mean forty two forty three thousand dollars back then very expensive and you don't want to just drive it that back to work and get out go in you know it, they're fun you're working hard you're paying the insurance you're paying the gas you're paying the upkeep the tires the brakes the oil all that stuff what enjoyment are you getting out of all that unless you're doing the work yourself okay that's a whole different video a whole different story but the point is and I'm sorry for jumping around again I got a hundred mosquitoes in here enjoy those vehicles enjoy them enjoy them enjoy them they're yours you worked hard to pay for them so that's all I'm going to harp on that. We'll see you in the next video. I hope you might have got an idea or two about something you might want to change in your car. I mean, it runs the gamut. You can even get different covers to go around your AC vents, your air vents. I mean, you can get covers to go around this. I was just trying to keep it $60 and under because, you know, with the everything that's going on in the world right now and everything, for a lot of people, money's kind of hard to come by, and I am now one of those. So, with that said, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to quit boring you. I got to go to the grocery store, pick up a few items, and we'll see you in the next video. Thank all of you so much for watching. Take care.